Okay, so now we'll move on to the colony blot, which is another form of southern blot. You want to make sure you do a replica plating. Basically, you know, you have like a little colony right here. And um, when you do clots, um, you basically have to lyse the cells. So you want to keep a master plate and keep it alive. So basically just kind of replica plate it onto, you know, a nitrocellulist or a nylon filter. And then, you know, um, after that, you add in the DNA probe. Um, oh, right, before you add the DNA probe, it's very important you soak it in an alkaline um, solution to denature it. So then you add the DNA probe to select for, you know, to see if you can find the genes that you're looking for. And um, usually DNA probe is a single-stranded. DNA allow hybridization to take place um, to have the DNA probe adhere to you know the on your nylon membrane and then um, you wash away the membrane the extras um, and see what remains with an auto radiograph and um, you match the you know the colonies with the one on the master plate and see if you can find a potential gene for the protein that you're looking for okay so basically those steps again, replicating, transferring to um, nylon, R, T, then um, soak an alkaline solution, RTA, probe, um, hybridize, and autograph. Ratapha. Ha. Ratapha. Oh, R is for replicating. T is for transferring. A is for alkaline solution. P is for probe. Ha. You know, H is for hybridizing. And A is for autoradiograph. Okay? That's colony blasts.